What's happening? Man, you see it. Anthony back with another video. In the background, got some. Can't get this thing straight. Yeah, that's more better. Uh, in the background, we're listening to Abysmalist. The name of this one is Vile Possession. This is a full length. Uh, these guys are from San Francisco, California. There's the inner three piece. There's the guys there. Out on Maggot Stomp this year. Came out in April, I think. Super cool stuff. Uh, cover art there. Soak that in for a second. Raul Gonzalez did that. Death Metal three piece, six tracks, a little over 31 minutes of music. Check it out. Boy's been at it since 2018. Had a demo in 19, then this. And uh, you see the old maggot stomp deal there, man. Check it out. Can't beat it. When you see the maggot stomp label, you know what you're going to get. And this is no exception. Uh, these guys are just super, man. You'll hear it playing in the background. Check it out. Pick you up a copy if you have not. I think you'll like it. Oh, let me check this out. You remember this? <laughs> oh. <clears throat> well, man. Oh, Maddie Daddy checked out the video and put me on a copy, man. Said he had an extra copy and hook me up. When I say Maddie Daddy, I'm talking about Sean Maddie of this band right here, man. Check it out. Helix, Rake of the Astral Leviathan. Sent that to me too, man. Also got a sticker. You see it? Super cool stuff, man. I was glad to get it. Sent it right on to me. Sent me a note, all that good stuff. Sean, Maddie, if you hadn't heard their music, man, those guys are awesome. Awesome, awesome. Can't wait to hear some new stuff from the Maddie boys. Wolf Lurch, Psychedelic Realms of Hell. Glad to finally get the thing like it ought to be, man. I couldn't stand that tore up copy. Could not stand it. Here, in case y'all didn't get that. Get y'all pull off of that. Put that in your pipe and smoke it. All right, let's check out some some records, man. Some records. My, my favorite format is records, vinyl records. I love uh, cassettes, demos, and uh, EPs on cassettes. CDs are all right. You know, I have some CDs, but my favorite, if I can afford it and if it's available, is the old black and round. Check it out, Decaying, One to Conquer. Uh, that's awesome, is it not? The guy that did the art is, let me read this, Barlamu Barlamage Kurzok B A R T L O M I E J Kurzok Check that out man that's awesome is it not There's the back cover if you're not familiar with decaying This is Finnish death metal uh, This one's 2014 uh, full length uh, came out on CD and then in 2016 Hell Thrasher uh, put out this vinyl. Cool stuff if you're not familiar with these guys. On this album they were a four piece. Oh AK-47 laid up there. It's war themed, military history themed death metal. Um, the opening track is a instrumental I'm pretty sure. Uh, it's got two vocal styles on it. One of them is that distressed Van Drunen style. Uh, excellent stuff. If you like uh, Hail of Bullets, um, some of the Ace Fix stuff, uh, any of that stuff, the opening riff on that, uh, what is it, Frequent Wind right there, sounds just like Season in the Abyss to me. 
maybe I'm wrong, who knows. If you haven't heard of these guys, they were a four piece on this one. You got eight tracks, a little over 41 minutes of music. Come on, Black. But they are awesome, man. I'm trying to, to round up the rest of their stuff. Um, like I say, Finnish death metal. Check this one out. That was their third full length there. Uh, this is their fourth full length. The name of this one is To Cross the Line. Roberto Cotterico uh, did that art. There you go, eight tracks. On this one, they scaled it down to a three piece and used a session drummer. Um, 2018 release on FDA Records. Shows four dudes there, but uh, Metal Archive said it was a three piece. I don't know, man, I stay confused. It's not hard to confuse me. It says Arco Talvanen did the drums on here. Who knows, man? Who knows? Three, four. It's awesome. All I can tell you, I, I mean, I don't know how many of them was up there, but it, how many of them was up there? They was all doing a good job. Is all I can tell you, brother. Like I say, finished death metal. Well produced. Uh, again, used the two vocal approach. Uh, one girder on one of the Van Drunen style stuff. Guitar driven. Uh, death metal. All this stuff, by the way, coming from Dark Descent. This was a Dark Descent order. I think this one's black. Yeah. There it is. There it is. Yeah, I think it. I got here in my notes a three piece on this one used the session drummer, but that's what mm, Metal Archive said. But maybe I got my wires crossed. Very possible very possible here's one that I was late to the party on and uh, don't know how I overlooked it you know Cody says I'm a 20 buck spin fiend and this is a 20 buck spin release ghastly uh, mercurial passages is the name of this one check out that art Rika Kaysanen I think is how you say his name the guys there three piece uh, seven tracks about 40 and a half minutes of music on this one these guys are from Finland as well check that out real heavy uh, inner they do it right even the inside of the inner is colored there inside of the thing is colored as well man 20 bucks spin does it right these guys have been at it since 2011 um, and they released their first demo in 11 as well then in 13 they had an EP uh, then their first full length was in 15 and put one out every three years and this is their third um, historically a two-piece uh, Ian J did all the instruments and Gassy Sam can't make it up Gassy Sam did the vocals but on this one they used an additional vocalist his name was Johnny Ripper uh, not the traditional Finnish sound um, they use more atmosphere the guitars aren't as thick as you would find in most uh, Finnish death metal bands but uh, they make it work and I enjoy it I need to work myself backwards and get the rest of their stuff but cool stuff man if you haven't heard of ghastly they are well worth your time check that out cool stuff man. absolutely cool stuff all right the next one is one everybody's been talking about i was a little bit late to the party on this one as well like i said this is dark descent stuff i picked all this stuff up at dark descent did i get the cast yes yeah. Uh, galvanizer the name of this one is prying sight of M perception this is a full length to uh, 2021 on Misako on Oho there's the guys on the back three piece you get 10 tracks on this one just a little over 31 minutes of music 
Stench Graphics did that. So that is, isn't that cool? Cool stuff. Death Metal slash Grindcore out of Finland on a Finnish roll right here. Like I say, three piece. Uh, let's see what you get in here. Ten tracks on here. Yeah, there's your inner. It's got a bunch of cool stuff on it. And on the back, it's got the lyrics. These guys have been at it since 2013. They had a demo in 14, an EP in 15, uh, then another demo in 16, and a full length uh, in 18, then this. Um, it's a, bend, a, a blend to me. It's a blend of finished death metal and modern death grind uh, with a lot of energy and a punky hardcore vibe to it. It's kind of it's kind of hard to explain. Um, mid to fast bass stuff's got that D beat. Uses two vocalists. Uh, good stuff. Need some more listens on this one, but I, I really enjoy it so far. Let's see, I think it's on black vinyl as well. Got some cool center labels on it. Anyway, you drop it on the old thing, it goes right through his pupil. Bet that hurt. Bet that hurt. All right, moving right along. We're moving out of Finland now into Costa Rica. Astrophirus, the lower levels of sentience. Um, this is an EP. I don't know if you can tell, but that's a, that's actually a, a cave there. 2020 release on Misako and Ho Ho. Um, Pulverized did the CD. Desert Wastelands did the cassettes. Uh, there's the guys on the back. No nod to the photo of the cave on the front, but death metal out of Costa Rica, as I said. Uh, four piece, you get four tracks on this one. A little over, about 20 and a half minutes of music. These boys have been at it since 2018. A demo in 19 and 20. Uh, then this, they had a split with uh, Blood Soaked Necrovoid last year. I think I showed you guys. I've got that one down there. Um, they, uh, like I say, they're, they're a four piece, but three of them uh, share the vocal duties on this and they go back in two and it, it's just, it's tremendous. mid paced death metal with doomy passages. Uh, definitely a nod to the old school with, you know, modern touches. Um, if you just picture a live show played in that cave, you'll, you'll know what it sounds like. Let me, let me, let me read the inner here. Check that out. Let me read you this. It says, uh, let me, it's, here's a thank you list and you'll know what you're getting. Hail's Demolition, Autopsy, Demolic, uh, Dramalic, uh, Demigod, Morbid Angel, Cannibal Corpse, Deteriorate, Depravity, Incantation, Seance, Crematory, Desultory, Benediction, and Abhorrence. What a list. Cool stuff if you haven't heard from these guys. Uh, well worth your money. Like I say, Dark Descent's where I picked that one up. And it is a EP, you know, with just the four tracks, but it's still cool. Check that out. Check it out. Right about now, Funk Soul Brother. All right, something a little on the blackened side of things. I seen my buddy Roger show this, and um, it's usually not my style, but I, I gave it a listen, gave it another listen, and I went ahead and picked it up. Um, this is from Dark Descent as well. I don't know if you can see that. This is Lucifer. It's dark. Uh, the name of this one is The Broken Seal. And uh, this is a full length. Let's see. Check it out. Tracks are on the back, but it's, it's dark. Uh, Daniel Valeriani uh, did this art. This is Black and Death from the UK, London, England. This is a 2021 release on Dark Descent. They did all formats. Um, a two-piece, you get nine tracks on this, about 43 and a half minutes. These guys have been at it since 2007. 
comes with a poster of the album art. I won't fold that out. And then it's got a cool inner. They had an EP in 2009, a full length in 11, a full length in 14, an EP in 19, and then this. Um, explosive drumming on this one, dark ass atmosphere, suffocating guitars, um, vocals that are just, like I say, that's the blacking part, the vocals, and it's they're powerful and they're perfect for this type of music. Uh, for a better description and a better summary of what this is all about, go to Metal Archives and look at the review on this. And Natskog uh, did a review on it. Uh, Y'all seen his channel. And uh, he can tell you a lot better all about this. But great stuff if you like your black and death metal. It's super. It is super. There you go. Same on both sides. Last but not least, check that out in the background. Maggot stomp. Can't go wrong, man. If it says maggot stomp on it, just go ahead and buy it. All right. Proscrito El Calvario. Calvario. El Calvario means the Calvary. If you look at this uh, cover, it's got all kind of crazy stuff on it, but if I'm not mistaken, that's Tony Iommi. <laughs> it's just got some crazy stuff on it. Um, Heresy Graphics did this collage uh, on here, what they call visual terrorism. Inside's more of the same. All right, Prescrito, what do you get with these guys? It comes with a, a, a poster as well, and no inner. Um, 2017 release on Iron Bonehead. This is an EP. Uh, doom, Death, Death, Doom, however you want to put it. From Spain, uh, three piece. You get five tracks on this one. A little over 30 minutes of music. These guys have been at it since 2016, and uh, this was their debut uh, EP. And they followed it with that full length in 2020. And uh, I've got it on CD, but I'm looking for it on album as well. All kind of crazy stuff going on in that cover. Uh, thick, heavy, doomy, miserable Spanish death metal. Vocals are in Spanish, so I have no idea what they're talking about but I really don't care because I love it. Uh, a must have for the Doom Junkie. Liam, this is you right here, brother. Cool stuff. Dark Descent's got them. Go get them. Listen to that. Still primitive. Primitive, still primitive. Good stuff, man. If you hadn't heard of Proscrito, Proscrito, uh, you need to check them out, man. They are awesome, awesome band. That's all I got, man. I appreciate y'all watching. Uh, Cody is, well, I told Cody actually, we just reached 500 subs on our channel, man. We're so appreciative to all you guys. Uh, Cody's been out of the net for uh, a couple months now, but he's He's eventually going to get back in. He's just got a lot of stuff going on. He's got some stuff he wants to give away uh, for our contest. He just hadn't had time to uh, get get everything lined up. But we're going to have a 500 uh, sub contest with a giveaway. And uh, he's got an al I know one album that he's got that he wants to give away that all you black metal guys will just go crazy about. I've never seen anything like it. But um, stay tuned for that. I, I Probably maybe the end of this week, first of next week, he should have that up and going and uh, we'll have something to give away that's worth your while. Appreciate you guys, man. Thanks for watching.